WFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials trading down 305, NASDAQ off 180, S&P's down 47. Gold, gold contract down $4.10, trading at 1796 an ounce. We have silver down 24 cents, 23 dollars 8 cents an ounce. Light sweet crude up 96 cents, 75 dollars 26 cents a barrel, notes and bonds. A 10-year note down 21 ticks, trading at a price point of 114.04. The 30 off a full point plus 12 ticks at 1. 29.25. You get the 10 year right now, folks, at three point yielding, 3.579. And King Dollar. King Dollar's up 28 ticks, trading 104.730. Euro 106. Yen 136.98. And the British pound at 121 to 1 US dollar. We get over and we take a look at the uh, spies first. This market might take, folks, we're going right for the lows. And I'm talking about the October lows, okay? Um, what you have here is this, okay? So, the, we had the gap. We've been talking about the gap, okay? So the bottom line goes into the gap today, blows by the gap today. What does that set up? That sets up, number one, it would be the highs of the lows, which is that 367. And the low is 348. The reason I'm saying here, yeah, so let's stay with this, okay? Bottom line, yes, it can go to the high of the low, but that's still 367. That's in your spies. We go to the NDX 100. We take a look at the Qs. What do you have with the Qs? The Qs are right at the gap now. Bottom line, the gap on the Qs, and was the price point of 268.56. You're at you hit 268.93. Now this is the kicker, and this is why I'm saying we're going for the lows. Watch this. That channel, that oh, let's see, put it right here. You can see this line coming across. We're already into the highs of the lows and the Qs. That's telling me we're going to go right to the lows. The lows of the Qs, 254 dollars 36 cents. And if we go to the look at the IWM. We're going to see the IWM is leading this baby. Um, bottom line, IWM, the high of the low in the IWM is 172, and we're already at 171 to 62. So that's telling me that somehow, some way, man, this king dollar is going to get a bounce. You know, it hasn't done it yet. We've had this kind of destruction, and it hasn't done it yet, okay? You can imagine when this thing gets a bounce. I mean, the dollar's down, man. And... So the correlation, you know, as, as this was bouncing, every time we would bounce, the market would go lower. Every time it just stayed flat, it didn't do anything. This thing bounces, man. This market's going to go south, and there's no reason to buy this week. That's, that's the kicker here, too. This is the week that it can power all the way down into those lower levels. Stay right there, folks. We'll come right back.